welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Um, so today I have a really exciting intro for a year long project pan that I'm doing. Um, it's called Partners in Cream as the title suggests. Um, and it was started by Stephanie and Daylin. I think that's how you say her name. Um, I will link their channels down below. Um, I was actually like added by Alex, um, from One Beauty Addict here on YouTube. We're kind of friends. And so she, um, told me about it. And so I decided to join because I thought it would be really fun. Um, so yeah, basically the project is what it says. It's like all cream or liquid products. Um, you can pick from three to five products. Um, and you can either make it like a short project pan or like a long project pan. It could be rolling or not rolling. It's kind of whatever you want to do. They're inviting a whole bunch of people. Um, I'm going to attempt because I'm still a noob at this whole YouTube thing. So I'm going to attempt to um, put the playlist or whatever they have in their little thread down below so you can check out everyone else that's doing this project pan a lot of people that i've been watching for years are doing this project pan so i'm really excited to see their intros um and cheer them on and so yeah let's go ahead and get into the intro i am doing this project to kind of go through a lot of my lip products that i have <laughs> neglected for you know a while. So yeah, I'm going to add those mainly in this project and like a few other random cream and liquid products that kind of, you know, I see fit. But for the majority of this project, I would like to do it a rolling style with five rolling in, rolling out type situation. Um, I want to try and pan them, not just do uses, but if I need to do uses because of one thing or another, I'll go ahead and state that. But for now, I want to make sure that this project is mainly completely finishing everything up. I just want to make sure that I, you know, am using up the rest of my lip products. Um, I kind of ended my lip project pan last year because um, I just needed a little break from it. And I was kind of naturally panning other lip products um, with other seasonal project pans and I kind of felt like seasonal project pans are where I um, do the best work <laughs> um, but with this year-long project pan um, I feel like it might work out <laughs> because of you know everyone else keeping me accountable and stuff and I feel like I've seen a few other videos and a lot of people are doing lip lip products as well so anyway yeah without further rambles let's go ahead and get into the products the first one um i'll go ahead and put a picture up of it, what it looks like right now at the intro it's my ColourPop supernova shadow um in the shade from the valley um i'm going to measure like tubes of things um on my scale so you can kind of see um how much i've used up and like the visual and the like measurable progress i guess um, but here's where we are right now. Um, as you can see, there's like a lot of windows within the bottle or the tube. And I just really would like to get this used up. I've had it for about two little, two years-ish. A little less than two years now. And it's still good. I still love this. Um, I wish ColourPop came out with more colors than just like the ba basic boring colors that they have um, because like out of all liquid shadows and glitters and stuff these are my favorite but I want to get these used up and get my money's worth while they're still good so yeah. The next thing I'm wearing on my lips right now is my NYX Intense Butter Gloss. Um, again picture of it on the scale. Um, <clears throat> I really love all of my lip products. A few of them aren't cruelty free, so I would like to get those out. But like the NYX Butter Glosses, I love them. I'm not trying to use them up because I hate them or anything or like I want to get them out of my collection. They're just something I would like to use up. So this is one of them for sure. Um, I have had this in my collection for about two years, which is like totally gross. But whatever, I'm tr it's still good. And I, you know, it doesn't smell or anything. So um, with that being said, I really would like to get this used up. Um, I forgot to mention at the beginning, but, um, with most of these, I'm going to try and do tallies to kind of show you how many times I've used it, um, between each update. So you can kind of see like 
how much I'm using up with like the amount of times it's been used if that makes any sense so yeah the third product I'm adding is my Revlon lipstick in Mauve Night again I'll put a picture of it next to its little like hash mark um yeah I had this in a project this past year and I didn't finish it unfortunately I've been using it a few times um from the end of my last project pan that was the 12 pans of Christmas until now and I still don't have it used up just because I wasn't wearing makeup for a little bit but also like I kind of just wanted to like see my other lipsticks and see what is still good and what needs to be tossed and I'm so glad I did that because there was a lot that went off unfortunately but anyway <laughs> um so yeah I have just like a little nubbin left and once it gets down to the plastic I'm literally gonna toss it because this is probably one of my oldest lipsticks or these two Revlon lipsticks that I have are my oldest but I'm just gonna work on this one for now and then toss in the other one maybe like later on you know when this one's done maybe we'll see the fourth product I have in this project is going to be my hourglass stick foundation I'm going to put it right here next to its hash marks um this one I I regret buying this honestly um it's not a very good foundation in my opinion by itself I only use it right now to kind of ante up the coverage in my foundation if I need it I'm wearing it kind of like on my chin around like my little breakouts and then like on right here where I get redness um and I only have a little bit left um I will never repurchase this but I do need to get it used up because um, it's getting close to its expiration date and I would just like to God, use up the 40 something dollar foundation that I stupidly bought and I will never buy again so and then the last uh, product ugh, <laughs> last product I have in this project say that 10 times fast um is my LA girl lip liner in wine um again picture over there next to its hash marks um I again had this in another project pan last year 2019 um and I really enjoyed it I found that it's not a deep shade it's more like a rosy shade so with that being said hopefully I will get these used up pretty quickly so I can roll in some more products to use up but for right now I'm gonna take it slow and use these five and hopefully get them used up because cream products go bad pretty quickly and I have a few of them so yeah um I'm really excited and look forward to seeing everyone's videos and then seeing everyone's progress um I love project pans so yeah um comment down below if you're also in this project pan um I'm going to try so hard to like go through the entire playlist and like watch everyone's videos and share everyone on um I'm really excited to find some new people that I haven't seen yet maybe hopefully but yeah anyway um thank you so much for watching I really appreciate it and until next time bye